what is going on guys today i wanted to talk to you a little bit about the brand new instagram tv and how to prepare to edit for vertical video in power director 16. so uh the first thing i want to talk about really quickly is just to talk about what instagram tv is our igtv if you haven't heard about it uh and you found this video i'm not sure how you found this video but if you know what i'm talking about igtv uh is a new video service that has been launched by instagram a couple weeks ago they launched igtv basically this is in a direct competitor for youtube uh the main difference here is that it is vertical so all video is vertical it's nine by 16 instead of 16 by nine aspect ratio so what does that mean for us as content creators that means that we if we're going to create content for instagram tv can do one of two things we can create horizontal videos for youtube like we normally have crop it and then post it to Instagram TV, or we can create brand new content that is designed specifically for Instagram TV. And so we'll take this clip right here. We're gonna drop it into PowerDirector 16, right? And so in the preview, it all looks great, right? That's exactly what we want. We bring it down into the timeline. Uh, well, actually, before we do that, up here, if you notice right here, it says 16 by nine. And this is actually where you can also change it to nine by 16. So this is a little, a little tip here. This is my second point, but we're going to go ahead and make this point right now. So you can switch it to 16 by nine or nine by 16 in this little drop down right here. The cool thing is, is if you have it in 16 by nine, for example, and you do pick a piece of uh, video that you recorded in nine by 16, as soon as you drag and drop it into your timeline, it's automatically going to ask you uh, about an aspect ratio conflict. So it's telling you that, hey, you got a 16 by 9 project, but you got 9 by 16 video. You should probably switch it. If you hit no, it's going to keep it 16 by 9, and you're going to end up with um, some cropped out looking weird video. Uh, but if you hit yes, it's automatically going to change the ratio to 9 by 16. And now you're ready to go. Now you've got some smooth looking, um, you know, you got some smooth looking video that is set up specifically for. Uh, for horizontal video for IGTV, which is great. So that makes it nice. Um, let's delete this and I'm gonna show you what happens. So if you don't do that switch, you got 16 by nine, you drop it down in here. It's gonna say aspect ratio conflict. No, I don't wanna change it now. This is what you end up with. So you end up with the, the opposite version of what I was explaining when I first went on to IGTV, but now you've got huge bars over here and huge bars over here. Um, and so that doesn't look very good. What I would do is then switch it back to nine by 16 ratio. It's gonna automatically edit and there you go, perfect fit. And so those are the two different ways that you can change your aspect ratio in Cyberlink PowerDirector 16 uh, to prepare and edit your video specifically for Instagram TV. So hopefully this was helpful. If it was, please don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions, please feel free to drop them down in the comments below. But other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Hey guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to check out the other videos that are popping up right over here, as well as don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel for more awesome reviews, and I'll see you guys next time.